Yes, I don't see what I go on here now, people. I do see what I go on, pan, what I go on. After netting Yahoo, go America. Go go talk to the big wigs, them. It seems like Hezbollah is being now blamed for a rocket attack on Israel. Yeah, greetings and salutations, yeah. It must be a coincidence, yeah, to all nations worldwide. You know what? Who get into the war? I ain't not ready for me to pack. I mean, other than ten by your side, because it's long time. Ha <laughs> ha! Subscribe to the Rastaman channel, people, because you know, say sometimes when we're looking at the news, me I wonder if I plan them planning up because after netting Yahoo. Yeah, with him genocidical mind and his agenda. Go America. Go go talk. All kind of idiot thing to the Jamaica um, to the American government. Me realize it. Suddenly there's a strike. There's a strike in Israel. And them say a Hezbollah do it. And Hezbollah say I say, no. Stop blaming me, cause me not do nothing. Hezbollah has been denouncing, saying that Israel is trying to create the context or pretext to create a bigger war. You are going to you gone too far. Israel says that 11 people has been killed by rocket strike in a town. Israel control in Golan Heights. You are going to whoever do it, it's not right. Cause a innocent, innocent people who not kill off and a go on like say oh no bright why people can't get together and unite a rocket strike Saturday on a soccer field killing eleven children and teen Israel authorities said in a deadly strike on Israel target in the country north border since the fighting between Israel and Hezbollah erupt. Listen. This is a risk to unleash a broader regional war. Israel blamed Lebanese militant group Hezbollah for striking him. Israel controlled Golan Heights, but as Bullah rushed to deny the role, Israel military called it very secret event and said it would act according. Hezbollah fired a rocket at children playing soccer in North Israel. It's then led to claims that it did not carry out the attack, said the military chief spokesman, Rear Admiral Daniel Hagari. He called it the deadliest attack in Israel civilians since Hamas attacked October 7. Mirated at that spark the war, Gaza against Israel. But cartel need to come out of jail because Israel a deal with Gaza. Wicked, wicked. Men on way for true had in a jail. But you know, when Gaza march out from the buckle field, Israel burial Gaza. Now, Hezbollah chief spokesman Mohammed Afif told the Associated Press that a group Categorically denies carrying out an attack on Majadala Shams. It's unusual for Hezbollah to deny attack. The militant group said its fighters carry out nine different attacks using rockets and explosive drones against Israel military posts, the last of which targeted the army command of Hamara Moon Bridge in Mahal Mali. Goliani, which Katus rocket, it said it was a response to Israel airstrike on villages in southern Lebanon. The strike followed early cross-border violence on Saturday when Hezbollah said three of his fighters were killed without specific specifying where. Israel military said its air force targeted a Hezbollah armed depot on border village of Kav Kar Kila, adding the militants were inside at the time. 
footage here on Israel Channel 12 showing a large blast in one of the village in the Druze town of Majdal Shams in the Golan Heights which Israel captured from Syria in 1967 Middle East war and annexed it in 81 video showed the paramedics rushing with stretchers off the soccer field like a yacht with an ambulance waiting Hail Mohammed a resident of Majdalsham told Channel 12 that children were playing soccer when the rocket hit the field. He said the siren were heard seconds before the rocket hit, but there were no time to take shelter. The officers of Israel, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu, who was on visit to the United States, said they would cut it short for the trip in several hours without specifying when he would return. Lebanon government, in a statement without mentioning Majdal Shams, urged immediate secession of hostility on all fronts and condemn all attacks on civilians. Ladies and gentlemen, war is in the air. But again, like I said, it's suspicious that as soon as the ICC, the International Criminal Court, and the ICJ at turn on the heat pan Netanyahu and his genocidical mind. And him run America with his backing because the United States of America are back this genocidical government. They are murdering, killing all the Palestinians that don't have an army. And the world is sitting by and watching a genocide of an ancient people. Removing them from their God-given property, their heritage, their rights, their roots, and their culture. But for some reason, the war will never be over because Bob Marley don't sing it in a song until the philosophy that holds one nation superior than another. They're always going to be war until the color of a man eye. Why? Or a woman's eye? Or another nation's eye? Until my eye color no matter. Then there's always gonna be war. Until the innoble and unhappy regime in Africa. Because it appears that there's a supremacy ideology among certain people that continue to keep their feet on the neck on regular people. A freeness, we say, I'm a free man. Don't you want to be a free man? I'm a free man. Don't you want to be a free woman worldwide? Everyone would say that. So everyone has the divine rights to live in a world of peace. And it appeared that these people want to gravitate closer and closer to the beast. It seems like a peer war, killing, murder, and all kind of virus. These boys are released. What uno a teach? Uno going to get it? Yeah, you know what I'm talking about? Uno going to get retribution from the most high. Because revelation reveal, and just like the act of a child that's always been bullied, sooner or later the little man stands up. Get up, stand up, stand up for the rights, for the rights of your brothers and sister. Quit being quiet because it seems like this boy is going to get we involved in a wider world war. Stop the war worldwide. Stop the fuss and the fight. Stop the false flags. Stop the psyops. Stop the racial divide. Stop the supremacy mentality. Stop the Greco Roman ideology. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Rastafari Soto here of Deep Roots TV. I'm reporting live here in the studio. The war just get larger because. Israel is blaming Hezbollah for drop a bomb on the playground. 
more life. Leave your comment. Make me know if them tech with a clown. Because it is ironic that Netanyahu just go America. Standing ovation from the Democrat and the reptilians them. And right now, hours before he reached back to his place, something start in kick off the war. I think he went to America to find out if it's okay to extend the killing and the desecration of people's nation and the stealing of the sacred land of the Palestinian. Leave your comment if you agree. Leave your comment if you disagree. Subscribe to the channel. Build up the Rastaman panel. Share the content to anyone you think that would want to hear the Rastaman. I'm Rastafari Soda here of Deep Roots TV. I'm more life. I'm more joy. I'm more fire. Panel. Deep Roots TV where it's gun time for the action part. Yeah. <laughs> Ola, Jenna, Jenna. Oh, you know about it, Pam? Deep Roots TV. Don't know a link, you know. See it for the water. First clean. Hustling more. You don't know. We just come to my store and sell. You know what things say. Get to you. So you know what thing go. You know what rich and the real thing. Like you mean action doing. Action and plan. Deep Roads TV. You know what thing go. Yeah, big up.